and this is where this is this is where I would say you're in a beautiful place. It's an amazing place right now, even though it doesn't seem like it or it doesn't feel like it naturally because it's painful and it's intense, it's confusing, and it's just you feel like you're being ripped apart. But there is definitely some pearls right in the middle of this to to receive and and the teaching here is the recognition of that which is that force that higher self that part is how enormous it is how big it is it's power it's presence that is capable of doing what it's doing and in that recognition of it in that very moment that the the awareness is here that no matter what is going on no matter how big of a storm is happening how powerful it is no matter how much is tearing me from inside out as if I feel like I'm being gutted is that it does not touch the power of awareness mm. no matter how powerful it is how much of a strong powerful storm it is is giving you this opportunity for this recognition that that not for one moment your power of awareness has been changed touched it has the circumstances the events of existence of what is going on has no power on your power of awareness you are still aware you have no power over your emotions your body your senses maybe you want to hide out you don't want to be around people you don't want to listen to any spiritual teachings you don't want to talk to any of your friends you don't want to hear them giving you any raps everything may be painful no one can understand or you just want to hide out and you may be doing it for weeks you may not don't want to even get out of the house but it doesn't matter what the body mind the emotions the senses are going to be doing they're just an, under a tremendous amount of pressure but none of this pressure has any power to touch your power of awareness you are still aware yes and thank you for the opportunity that i could share that with all of you today because usually i keep hiding <laughs> yeah, I understand. so and it was I guess good for I mean I was happy that I could join <laughs> today. Well, yeah, I'm, I'm really happy you did. I'm really happy you did. So if you just right now in this moment come come to this place. Because this is a beautiful moment we have together. And we are here right now and you're cap you're seeing what's going on you're aware of what is happening to your nervous system how any of it can touch your ability to be aware nothing nothing The ability to be aware in the midst of this storm 
this fire that is burning through, ripping things apart, destroying everything. How can it touch my ability to be aware? <laughs> That is an indication of a multidimensional being. The capability of still being aware. Now, one thing that cannot change, it cannot be taken away from you or it cannot be added to. So this fire, this intensity is definitely burning illusions, ideas of how things should be, how I should be, I shouldn't be going through this. This should not be happening to me. This should not be happening to my nervous system. This should not be happening to my body. All the ideas we have of our definition of an advanced spiritual being. So you come back to the heart of awareness, to the very center, and you will see that nothing has the power to touch it. Because that's the one non-changing truth of your life, of your existence. The very presence which is here and it's not conditional. no matter what happens. Even when Kali comes to your life and is determined to cut your head, to rip you apart and burn you and tear, tear you into pieces and is doing it, but it can't touch one thing. One thing doesn't get touched. The very fact that I am, you are, you are here, and you're aware, you're aware of all these things, very painful, are very joyful. We don't pay attention so much to it when we're going through joy, but it grabs us when we're going through pain.
but the knowing doesn't change. I know, I'm aware. Okay, well, thank you. Appreciate it. Thanks for the input. Okay, nice seeing you all. I look forward to seeing you next week. Okay, God bless. Thank you.